Hey guys, in this tutorial, I am going to show you how to place a virtual house in the real world. You can then resize the house, change its position and even enter the house. In this tutorial, I will not teach you how to code this application, but we are going to follow a different approach. That is, we are going to download the sample app provided by Apple in WWDC 2017 and make some minor modifications to get our application up and running. So before starting the tutorial, just make sure that you have Xcode 9 installed in your Mac as well as iOS 11 installed in your iPhone. And after you are done with it, just make sure to download the two files I have given in the description. One is the Apple's sample project, the other one is the model that we are going to use in our application. So once you have done that, just resume the tutorial. I hope you have downloaded the two files provided in the description. One is this one and one is this one, the model of the house. Now just open the Xcode project, sample project, open and go to resources, go to models.scn assets and these are some of the models, demo models provided by Apple. We don't really need them. So we'll just delete it and create our own model. So just press delete, move to trash. Now create your own folder, new folder, give it a name, model. Now we have this house model, which we will just drag it in beneath this. Yeah. So now we have our model up and ready. Just click on it and press this button on the bottom left corner. Now we will get this sketch up. Click on this. Rotate it by 90 degrees. Now, yeah. Now just delete this camera thing. Click on it and press delete. We don't need it. The house is too big. It's 401 meters width, 616 meters height and 269 meters depth. So just scale it down to 0 0.001, 0 0.001 and 0 0.001. Now we have the perfect version of our house. Yeah. Now we have a file model.dae. We have to convert this into .scn format because DA is not recognized by Xcode. So just go into editor and convert to scenekit file. Convert. Yeah, so now it is converted to model.scn. Now just go to virtual objects folder, this one. Just open it and open virtual objects.json file. Delete all of this. We don't need it this comma also then name it to model this one to model as well now go to virtual objects dot swift file and this is the image this image is basically set to nothing right now so we'll just set it to cup cup So this is just a random image present in our assets.xc assets folder, this one. Now make sure you have a device which is running on iOS 11 because we will need this device running on iOS 11 for our project to run on. So now to run on a device, just click on AR cat example, select the team to which you have signed for and then just press run. And what you will see is this.